on Thursday, it was the uh, chocolate box question on the uh, higher paper that got my students and a lot of students, according to the uh, newspapers, fairly animated. Yesterday, Friday, it was the Nat5 uh, exam, and it was two questions that got people animated, it seems. This one, which is the snowman question, and another one, which is kicking a ball off a cliff, which we'll look at in a separate video. But here is the snowman question. And this is kind of typical of a number of, of Nat5 uh, questions over the years. It involves circles and also Pythagoras, um, which I know, uh, speaking to my students, uh, a lot of them spotted it because we've gone through this type of question quite a few times because they, they always seem to come up. I won't read the question to you. However, what I will do is just highlight on here that the small circle has a diameter. This circle here has a diameter of 15 centimetres, which means the radius across here is going to be 7.5 half of 50. And this is also a radius across here, which is 7.5. And that means, just concentrating on this uh, quadrant here, that we have a right angle triangle like this. And uh, the trick with these questions, and often you can see it or you can't, but what I'm looking for is the hypotenuse of this right angle triangle, which takes me from the center of the body of the snowman to a point on the circumference. And of course, that's the radius. And what's the point of calculating that? Because that radius there is going to be the same as this radius down here. And so once I've got the radius, which is the hypotenuse, uh, from Pythagoras, c squared equals a squared plus b squared. So c squared is going to equal 7.5 squared plus 7.5 squared. So I ended up with c squared equaling uh, 112.5. And so c equals 10.61 uh, centimeters. And what they're asking for is the overall height of this snowman, which is the diameter of the head plus the radius of the larger circle. So that would be 15 plus 10.61, um, which I ended up with uh, 25.61 centimetres. And as I said, that's a, a fairly typical Nat 5 question over the years. Uh, going back to the standard exams, we've had the depth of water in a semicircular uh, gully, uh, the thickness of concrete at the bottom of a, a tunnel. Um, we've also had the uh, level of milk in a uh, tanker, all uh, concerned with essentially finding a missing length in a right angle triangle. And the trick is to construct the triangle. So hopefully that makes sense for everybody. Any comments you have or any other things that you can spot in this question, then please comment below. And here comes the shameless plug. Your maths tutor, we can help uh, people of all ages and abilities with maths. This is a, a screen grab of our website. Uh, you currently find me in the online classroom and I work with students all over Scotland, um, either face to face in and around Edinburgh or online. And uh, yeah, if you like this channel, then please subscribe and it would be a pleasure to hear from you. Thanks a lot then. Cheers. Bye bye.